Previously on Deep Bar Deep. Jersey Driver, you wanted to elevate Meth Orc uh, so that you could then take over as the deepest one by uh, killing off Harkel's daughter. Jacques! They believe that they have us trapped in this room, but I have 100% confidence as a security expert that if I needed to, I could kill every one of them. Now I don't have to, because we're all having a friendly conversation. Did you not touch this food when you were preparing it? Well, you gotta wear gloves. Mm-hmm. What would happen if you didn't wear gloves? That's a great question, Captain. I mean... What would happen? I've never touched it without gloves. Let's find out. And I pick up the bag and I go to dump it on top of Jersey Drive. <laughs> and I would like I, to I have to stop you. The Energy just sort of blasts forth from his hands and goes whipping over the two of you and Harkle. Harkle um, goes flying back against the wall. Harkle, no! Your Majesty! Wham! And collapses. No. No. She has sustained a grievous wound uh, on the back of her head. Yeah. Um, you can see, you can see brain. Oh, oh gosh. Great. Maybe they don't need it as much as we do. <laughs> <laughs> so it makes me think of like the scenes in Vietnam movies where someone's like, I can put it back in. Yes. I'm okay. So uh, I have a theory. Okay, let's hear it. <laughs> so if we were to find a natural source where the drift walk and the deep water meet, it could potentially cure the princess. I have heard of such things. They are very rare. Uh, it's very dangerous, uh, but I do know that they exist out well, there. If anyone knows where it would be, it would be that cool guy. You ever seen a place where the deep water meets the drift rock? That smug chuckle means yes. <laughs> yeah. It <seems laughs> Called it. Cool he was guy. right. Yeah, I seen a place like that. But I'm gonna warn you. Last time I was there, ah, boy, some enormous creature appeared. What did it look like? About ten feet tall, made out of metal. Hmm. Ooh. What a big old sword. So. Are we ready to roll? We were born ready. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better. I like this one. He right. likes me. Hey, Zara. <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> you must prove yourself worthy, champions. Is, is there a prologue that needs to happen, or can we just go for it? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's do this. One, two. Oh boy. Three Whoa. attacks rain down on your head. Oh boy. Ah. Oh yeah. <laughs> hey guys, this is a bad. Yes, exactly. Shh, robots. I'll allow that. Okay. Again, it looks super yeah. cool, so. <laughs> Do you need a calculator? No, no, I can do simple math. <laughs> reflex saves are gonna be amazing. I know, it's gonna be fantastic. Hey! <laughs> Don't be a hero. <laughs> <laughs> I am worthy. <laughs> See his true face, oh, it's hideous. <laughs> 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 oh, that's you. That's you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no! Yeah, all right, moving on. Let's pretend that didn't happen. Mira! I'm a weak little wizard person. <laughs> you wind up Literally in your solar die, weapon. Literally die, is yeah. what I say. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Just, ah, yeah. Die, and yeah. die it does. An enormous 30-foot creature, which stands in front of you, comprised of those creatures okay, from Okay, my robots. next turn, I'm going supernova. On this <laughs> so. it looks at you, and it says... Congratulations, champions. You have proved yourself worthy. Thank you. I don't know. I feel underwhelmed by my performance. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like bestowing any gifts upon us? Indeed. All right. <laughs> he gestures to the fountain? Yes, he gestures to the fountain. Okay. 